What's up guys, it's Aaron and Mar. Welcome back to Mario Kart 8, where we're going to continue the DLC cups, and it has been so, so long since I've actually touched Mario Kart 8. I forgot that I had actually left two of the DLC cups uh, untouched in video form, so what we're going to do is take those on in the 200cc game mode and this one and the next episode, so do apologize for that, um, but we will just get to that right now. And today I guess I'm going to use the me a beat me. Okay, I, I read two words that weren't really connected. We're gonna use the me using amiibo costumes. I've unlocked both the Captain Falcon and the Fox suit. I'm gonna go with the Captain Falcon one because I believe the next uh, the next cup has Captain Falcon Mute City in it. If not, I'll just use it on the wrong thing. It don't matter. Um, and I don't even I forget what everything does. I know that this Mach 8 with the rollers um, are really good, but I'm just gonna go with something random. So we're gonna go Circuit Special. Uh, we'll go with Crimson Slim, because that looks, sounds like Crimson Chin. And then we'll use the Cloud Glider. Um, so I haven't touched uh, the Triforce Cup or the Bell Cup. The Triforce Cup, of course. You know what? We're going to save Captain Falcon for the next time, because this time we're going to do the Triforce Cup, which means we're going to be using Link. And he is all ready to go. So uh, I know that he uses a bike, but I'm not really a huge fan of bikes. Um, I w Which one is his? He's got... It, it's... The Master Cycle, that's it. But I'm not a huge fan of those. Um, so I'm going to go with a cart. Maybe I'll just use what I was going to use before. That looks like it'll be good. Link doesn't look uncomfortable in that at all. But here we go. We're going to do the Triforce Cup. Comes with Wii's, uh, Mario Kart Wii's Wario's Gold Mine. Uh, Mario Kart Super... Uh, oh my gosh. Super Mario Kart's Rainbow Road. And then two new ones. Ice Ice Outpost and Hyrule Circuit. So... Let's jump into it. If you guys could do me a huge favor and hit the like button before we get started, or I guess as we get started, that would be awesome. And please, please, please pardon how poorly I'm going to be playing uh, in this video. Oh my gosh. 200cc not only on top of everything is super hard, um, but I'm pretty rusty with Mario Kart in general. Uh, Mario Kart 8 really sort of died on me. Uh, once I like understood that the item imbalance really wasn't helpful 200cc really brought it back for me a bit um, But I can't really play online the way I did Mario Kart DS or Mario Kart Wii or even Mario Kart 7 for uh, you know a little bit uh, Just because I don't know there's something about not being able to um, Not being able to catch up sometimes really really ruins it for me, so I'm uh, just gonna Just blame it on me falling off cool so I'm just gonna um, blame th blame my poor gameplay on that. Oh, I didn't know you could bounce off of the minecarts in this. Oh, this is so sick. That's so clever. And then we drop back into normal carts. Yeah. Oh, that is... Man, this is pretty well done. I like how they're sort of adapting old courses to be... To, to, to what Mario Kart has now become with the, uh, the gliders and now the... What is it? Anti-gravity uh, hovercraft type deal? I don't know what it's called. The, I, the hovercraft, I guess, is what you can call it. Anti-gravity sounds way too fancy. Way too fancy. But yeah, you can uh, you can bounce off those now, which... Alright, cool. Which is great, because they used to get in the way. You sort of have to go around them. Now you can just sort of bump into them and let them take you wherever your heart desires. Except for when Toadette steals your, uh, your items because it bounced off of you. Well, that's cool. That's just cool. What did you hit me with? Oh, oh, get out of the way. Nice, that would have been me. So, maybe, maybe I'm glad that uh, you got hit. Although, Baby Mario is now in the way. Um, oh, no, I'm about to fall off. Gosh, brake turning really, really, or brake drifting, whatever you want to call it. It really saves your butt sometimes, but also screws you over because it's really hard to gauge sometimes. You have to get really used to the cart that you're playing as. Uh, or really get, get really used to one cart and how it turns. And if you're switching around a lot, then you don't really get the benefit of that. Alright, train tracks turn back into normal, and boom! Fantastic! So we actually uh, did pretty good this time, uh, which I, I was a little bit hesitant on. Wario's Gold Mine was infamous for everyone falling off. Uh, I guess in more casual play, I'm sure the competitive Mario Kart Wii scene really didn't have that problem, but uh, for the most part, I always fell off of Mario Kart Wii, and as far as I know, most of the people I played with, you know, in real life at like parties and things, uh, definitely did as well. So here we go, Triforce Cup, Super NES, Rainbow Road. Oh, I'm so glad they brought this back. This one's a nice one. Because, uh, I don't know, it's, it's, 
The first Rainbow Road, so it's got its own little character because it was on, you know, Super Nintendo, so it wasn't on a three-dimensional console, technically, and they really adapted it very well for, um, for, what's it called, for Mario Kart 8, which is what I was saying about the last one as well. Uh, the way the, the, like, this is not a new, um, concept where the thwomps will make the ground shake, uh, but they adapted it well in that you can do flips and stuff. So, or tricks, which give you, like, the special, uh, speed up. So, I don't know. That's nice. Alright, right one, so we're gonna do that. No! Oh, gosh, that was close. That was very close. Alright. I'm gonna pretty much avoid all of the jumps, because they get me going too fast for the turns. Um, and so I would usually end up careening off the side into death. Oh, that was almost lucky. Almost lucky. But we had such a... We have such a big lead that it's pretty much not going to matter. Uh, Rosalina is kind of catching up, but as long as we don't fall off again, we should be good to go. Uh, because as long as this is a banana. Or a shell, and of course it's not, it's a coin. That's one of my biggest complaints. I feel like I've talked about this in a previous part, but it's been so long, I'll just do it again. Um, the fact that you can get coins and item boxes really leaves a bad taste in my mouth. Uh, like... Are we about to lap somebody? We're basically lapping this person. That's how short this course is and how poorly they did. Um, because you literally are... There's no shortage of coins. Coins are constantly respawning. And... Um, and you, I pretty much always end with 10. So there's really no reason for me to be collecting coins. Or if there is, if you really are insistent on me collecting the coins, give me the ability to hold more than 10. The fact that I can only hold 10, uh, and once I hit 10, there's no overflow, Really, really kills it for me. But here we go. We're um, we're going to do the third race, which oh, I did not. What? All right. Well, I forget what this course is called, but it's a new one anyway. Um, it looks like we're in an ice Antarctica place. All right. All right. I guess you could just hit me with that right off the bat. Cool man. Cool man. So all right, we got. Man, I was gonna say we have a fifth place lead to catch up to, but now we have an eighth place. Uh. Uh, or, or comeback, I should say, to make. So here we go. Drop down. All right, let's use some of these mushrooms. Nope, I saw that banana coming from a mile away. All right, aha, you got hit by it, because I was really worried I was going to get hit by that banana. So that's that's good. Okay, so these are basically always constantly two splitting paths. You either take blue to go low or yellow to go high, it looks like. Or maybe it's just they're different, you know? Anyway, I fell off. Cool. Um, should I throw that? I'll throw that this way. Nope, it bounced. No, oh gosh, that's gonna blow up on me. That was if I hadn't gotten out of the way. Okay, okay, okay. So, if you take the high road, it looks like, like, switching off halfway through really does actually help a, a fair bit. Oh, I'm doing so bad on these. It doesn't help that I've never played on this track before. Some of the other tracks I've played on in single race, but this one I don't think I've ever actually touched. Which is weird, but we're still in fifth place, and of course I missed an item box. So now I have uh, no item to catch up with. Great. Alright, Iggy just barely got out of the way. Up, oh, Toadette stole the first one, and whoever respawned stole the second one. Of course I got randomly hit by a green shell, and that always how it goes. You can somehow avoid the red shells, but green shells you just, you just somehow can't avoid. Alright, so this is... The first item I've gotten in two item box sections. Alright, third place, not bad, not bad. If I can get third, if I can keep third, maybe get second? Nah, nowhere near. Those hit, they hit him, Bowser Jr. up ahead, but didn't manage, or dry Bowser, I guess. Uh, but didn't manage to do it in time. Good thing we're still in first place, though, because Baby Rosalina didn't get second last time, so uh, she didn't have the next highest amount of points that you could get. All right, so with that out of the way, let's go on to the one that I have played, which is actually uh, the Hyrule Circuit. Uh, just because I have played it, by the way, does not mean that I'm going to be good at it. There's a nice Master Sword room in there. Uh, but just because I have played it does not mean I'm going to do well, like I said. I am actually anticipating to do very terribly this time around. Oh, this is the last race, too. I forgot. Man, 200cc races go by so fast that you just... Totally, uh, like, like, you totally lose track of time sometimes. Alright. Love this theme, by the way. Love this, uh, I guess it's a remix? And I also love, like, the, the skin of, oh, 
I thought I could flip over there. Cool, man. All right, it sounds like I can... The next round... I heard something... Or the next lap, I heard something... Like, some, like, stone thing grinding. So it sounded like something was opening up. Oh, man. But, yeah, I like how, um... The swoopers are now keys, and the piranha plants are now, uh... What are those? Deku Babas? I think? Alright, alright, alright. So we're fourth place, which isn't too bad, considering I totally just got stopped. Alright. Quick, quick, quick. Get rid of the, the sludge. Because I want to see if I can't... No, I can't go on there. Okay. I don't know why I thought I could. You know, and of course, we got a rupee. But we're in first. I don't know how, but we're in first. All right, well, we took too wide of a turn, so we are officially in third. But we're about to be in second. Dang it. Third again. We're about to be in third. All right, all right. I am doing so bad at this. It's not even funny. All right, if I can get up close enough, I can hit at least two of them. Or none of them. I don't think I hit any of them. But as long as I pass them, it doesn't matter. It's just that when they get the uh, the ink on them, they totally uh, slow down. Okay, okay. Okay, let's... Let, oh, didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Don't catch up. Dang it. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. That And that was the only character that could stop me from getting first. Was Baby Rosalina. But I think... There we go, we got it. Oh man, we did it. All is good. Yeah, there's no one close to us. Baby Rosalina is a full nine points ahead, so, or behind us, we are a full nine points ahead. So, there we are, finished with whatever cup this was, the Triforce Cup. Oh my gosh, Aaron, you gotta pay attention, man. I, I just, I forgot. I didn't really forget, I just don't know why I said um, I forgot because I didn't really. I knew what we were literally just on the Hyrule map. Like, why would I not know that? But there we go. And got ourselves one star. Not too bad considering I am bad at Mario Kart right now. And forever and always. But there we go. I guess in my own time I'll be able to um, go after getting three stars on all the cups. If you guys saw when we were on the, uh, the cup select screen, I had three stars for a lot of them. Only the DLC cups really I haven't focused on getting three stars yet on. Um, but that's when I, like, on my own time, I do that. But anyway, I'm rambling. There's no reason for me to be talking. Uh, next time, we're going to be taking on the Bell Cup, I believe. Uh, which is the final DLC cup that I need to take on. So, uh, we'll be doing that and finishing up this project that was sitting there unfinished. Unbeknownst to me for quite some time. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to hit the like button down below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Have a fantastic day, guys.